cause him. I don't want to get jumped. Jackson, <laughs> how are you going? I was too young for that. Myself. Tessio. Probably that chip shop guy, Glenn, when he sells chips, he's <laughs> Um, Wesley. My year seven crush, that would be Didier Renzaho. <laughs> one spicy specimen, if I can say so myself. Jordan Torres. I will miss schedule. Being late to school every day. Being late and living across the road. Oh, yeah. Being late in general. Graduating early. Just, just, I'm going to go real cheesy here. The friendships, the mateships. Oh. The people. Having a solid routine in my life, probably. Well, I'm missing my high school, I'm missing all my friends. Yeah. I'm gonna miss everyone. The home time bill. Oh. 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 I'm probably gonna miss the free food from Miss Kitchen in our food tech. Oh. <laughs> My favorite memory of high school is friends, people, teachers, and other cleaners and people. Um, year 11 camp. How do I go? Memory is the year 7 camp. Okay. Memory is what we did when we did stop, when we did um, stop and motion, and I got to bring in my own stuff. My most favorite memory was being prefect, and I think that'll stay with me for the rest of my life, basically. My favorite memory is going going bowling and laser skirmish. <laughs> Mine is nearly eating a caterpillar from the um, wrap at the canteen. I think my favorite would have to be both year seven and year eleven camp. It was really fun and mud course and everything. Oh yeah, that was yeah. Love the mud course. <laughs> Mine was year eleven camp. All the harmony um, days and like just all the times when our school spirit really shows and it's really, I don't know, it's ah, I'll miss you! <laughs> My favourite memory was probably when I was a cupcake at the Beauty of the Beast musical. <laughs> Um, I'm sorry for annoying all the teachers with my weird laugh. I'm sorry to Miss McDonald for stealing all your art supplies. I'm sorry Miss Kitchen for lighting the tea towel on fire that you never knew about. Have you ever laid in bed and it's late in the night? Staring at the ceiling, talking to God about life. And I'm when it's gonna happen, just maybe you might. Made a lot of light turns, but I wasn't right. Wanna know when it's your second, your minute, your time. Sick of dreaming, wanna let the pictures in your mind. Never been like all the I'm sorry. I passed all my chem exams. <laughs> Chemistry is easy. No one ever said I'm that. I'm excited for exams. <laughs> yeah. I got so much sleep last night. Bitch pump is easy. <laughs> Like I said before, it depends on whether everyone edits this or not. Um, I've known most of you from when you were very little, and then you know within a year you've grown so much physically, and I think you know mentally and spiritually as well. And I could see a lot of wonderful people uh, in that group of yours. And you know every uh, sort of dream that you have and what you want to do in the future, you know everyone gets there differently. So it doesn't really matter how. The most important thing is that you are happy. How you do that is up to you. But if you ever want to talk to me, no worries. Good luck. Year 12, it's been such an incredible journey uh, that you've been on and that I've been on with so many of you at different points. Uh, look, it's going to break my heart to see you go. Um, and all I can say to you is just keep being those people that you've become over the last few years, especially this this last year has just been so much 
change and growth in all of you. And I'm just incredibly proud to have, have guided so many of you through your time here and I'm really hoping that we'll, we'll keep learning about you know, what you um, ended up by um, choosing to do with the next few years of your life. So um, goodbye and have a wonderful, wonderful time. Hello, my name is Mr. Davis and I care about you. Now, rather than just congratulate you like I'm sure every other teacher has done, I want to give you some advice and it's advice that I wish somebody had told me when I was your age. Um, and it's in terms of careers and basically just how to go about living life. The first thing is, if there's one bit of advice that I could give you, it is trust your gut. The other thing is, in terms of careers and jobs and doing things, Sometimes you have an idea and you do it and it doesn't work out and that's okay, that's normal, that happens to a lot of people. And not often does it happen where somebody chooses something and they do it and it just works out. So, try something, if it doesn't work out, try something else. So, embrace failure, try different things and if they don't work out, try something else and listen to your gut. And if you do that, you will probably uh, end up in a good place. Alright, best of luck and see you in the future. Bye. Congratulations, Year 12. Good luck with your HSC and everything else. It has been amazing knowing you all, so best wishes. Good luck, Year 12, and have fun. Bye. Bye. Be awesome. Hey, guys. How are you going? Been awesome watching you growing from Year 7 up till now. Coaching, teaching. Some of you are way beyond my help. But just remember, you've made it this far. So at the beginning, go out, work hard. Hi Year 12, congratulations on your graduation. It's a very important day and a very special day and you've worked very hard to, to be here today. Um, I wish you all the best for the future and I hope that you look back on your time at the high school with, with fond memories. Congratulations Year 12 on your graduation. We are going to miss you all. Best of luck for the future. We'll all see you in the office. Bye! Bye. <laughs> Hi Year 12, yes it's been a long journey together, um, starting back from when you were in Year 7 all the way through to now and you finally hit Year 12 after 13 years of schooling. I wish you all the best and can I say the journey has been an adventurous one for you and me and all of us together. Some of you did it very easily, others we dragged, kicking and screaming, but we all got there and in the end. I do wish you all the best in the future. I hope that you get all your dreams and aspirations that you desire and good luck and come back one day and say hello. We'll always be here for you. Good luck. I hope you are having a wonderful graduation ceremony and I want you to think about your future and to always strive to be the very best version of yourself. And during your journey into the future, I want you to think about this. The greatest danger for most of us is not that we aim too high and miss it, but that it is too low and we reach it. I want you to think about that as you journey off into your world and your future. Goodbye, Year 12. <laughs>